Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Vlogmas video. Today we're talking about one of my very favorite topics in the entire world. <laughs> That's probably a little bit dramatic, but we're talking about Christmas movies and I love Christmas movies. What's gonna make this video a little different is that we're not talking about like the top 10 family friendly Christmas movies. No, no. We're just talking about Angie's favorite Christmas movies. So I am in no way condoning these movies as movies that you should watch with your children. While some of them are appropriate for kids, some of them are not. I just wanna share with you the movies that I love to watch during this season. Um, these are the movies that I will like lay in bed at night and watch um, with my cup of coffee or my cup of tea. So these are in no particular order. I'm gonna share these movies with you guys. It's just no particular order. I didn't feel like ranking them one through 10. I just wanted to give you my top 10 Christmas movies. I've got my Christmas sweater on, my Jolly Happy Soul sweater. I'm feeling in the Christmas spirit. I've got my coffee, red fingernails. I'm just, I'm all ready to talk about all the things Christmas movie. Here's the other thing I'll say. Some of these movies are not actually Christmas movies. They're just movies that contain some kind of Christmas theme. And for me, I think they're like unconventional Christmas movies. I think of them as Christmas movies but they're not technically branded, labeled, sold, advertised, promoted as Christmas movies. Okay, number one is White Christmas. Obviously, that is just a classic, classic Christmas movie. One I can watch with the kids or by myself. It's a great um, background movie to have running while we're decorating the tree or we're baking cookies or really just doing any kind of Christmas activity. I just love White Christmas. I spend like half the movie trying to figure out why that chick's waist is like this big around. I don't understand it. I don't know how it's possible. I want to know where are her organs? Where are your internal parts? Where are they? If your waist is only this big, where does everything go? I really don't understand it. But the dancing, oh, I just love it. Number two is gonna be another one that you can watch with your kids, even though I would totally watch it without my kids, and that is Muppet Christmas Carol. Um, I love the Muppets version of A Christmas Carol. Love it so much. It is our, we don't watch it any other time but Christmas Eve, because I don't want it to become something that people get bored of or anything like that, so that's the rule in our house. It is our Christmas Eve movie. That is the only time of the year ever that we watch it is once on Christmas Eve. I will watch it on Christmas Eve until I'm dead. Like the lamp, not the rat, like the lamp, not the rat. Number three is Fred Claus. I'll leave it to you if you decide that that is appropriate for your kids or not. In some of these movies, there's just questionable things that I'm like, I don't know if kids should probably watch that. But I love Fred Claus. I just very much along the lines of my sense of humor. And so I appreciate that. And I just think it's a funny, unconventional Christmas movie um, that takes a different spin on things. It's got all the feels and it's just really, really funny. I mean, even just in the beginning, that's the fattest baby I've ever seen. When Santa is born, he's just this big, fat, chubby baby. Just makes me up and he says, oh, oh, oh. It's hilarious. You know what? I think we will go through the more family-friendly ones first. Number four is Christmas with the Cranks. Um, I think Tim Allen is pretty darn funny. Um, I appreciate that he's like unapologetically himself and yeah, he's just, he's kind of funny. He's a funny guy. Doesn't mean I agree with everything, but I just think he's funny. I just really love Christmas with the Cranks. That is one that's usually one of my first few movies that I watch every Christmas. I start watching it in the evening as I'm going to bed. I've seen it a million times. I could probably recite the whole movie. Um, so that is another like good background noise movie for me where I'll watch it. Um, but I don't need to watch it to be able to just like follow along with the whole thing the entire time because I've seen it so many times. Where he gets Botox and he's eating those little mandarin oranges and he's like, <laughs> and they're like falling out of his mouth. It's just funny. It's a good, funny movie. Like it. Number five, of course, is Home Alone. I don't care who you are. I don't care how old you are. Home Alone is still just ultimately one of the very best Christmas movies ever made. I love it. Um, I don't love... I don't love the sassiness of the children in that movie. Like when we watch it, my kids kind of look at me like, oh, I can't believe, like, I don't love the sassiness. I'm not here for it. I don't like the disrespect, but the movie overall, I really like. It's a classic. It, who, do, who doesn't love Home Alone? I feel like everybody loves Home Alone. Although I'm certain there's people who don't because there's people who just don't like everything. So if you are somebody who doesn't like Home Alone, tell me below in the comments because I've never met someone who doesn't like Home Alone. So I'm sure you guys are out there but I've never met you. 
So if you're one of them, tell me down below in the comments if you don't like that movie. Okay, now we're gonna hop over to the less conventional Christmas movies, um, movies that are not necessarily advertised as Christmas movies, and most of these nay all of these are adult content movies so you probably don't want to let your kids watch them there is one movie in this list that i let my kids watch judge me if you want to number six on the list is funny farm this is another chevy chase movie i just now realized as i said this that this is gonna have to be like a top 11 because how did i not put christmas vacation on the list christmas vacation 100 percent. oh my gosh okay sorry top 11 Christmas Vacation, I, that's obviously, although I know there's lots of people who don't like that movie. But Funny Farm is another Chevy Chase movie. It is not a Christmas movie. Um, part of the movie takes place during Christmas time, but for me, it, I just, I, my brain correlates it with Christmas. I love that movie. It is so funny when he eats the lamb fries and then he finds out that they're actually sheep balls. It's so funny, so funny. When he rolls the boulder down the hill to get the mailman, it's just, it's a really funny movie. You guys will find that I have a very weird, odd taste. CR tolerates some of these movies. He does not care for like Funny Farm and stuff like that, but he tolerates it for me because I have a weird sense of humor and stuff like that is really funny to me. Okay, number seven is The Holiday. Um, again, not necessarily a Christmas movie, but I absolutely love this movie. It is so cute. It's a very like modern Christmas movie. This is definitely top of the list for me. I love the storyline. I love the older neighbor man, Kate Winslet, and she just, all of it. Cameron Diaz is great. It's a nice like romantic-y Christmas movie. Okay, number eight is Last Holiday with Queen Latifah. This is the movie that I let my kids watch that you might judge me for. There's a few parts in it that I'm like, I don't love, um, but I, should say like my older kids watch it. The younger kids don't really pay attention. Um, anyways, I realize that's probably questionable on my parenting, but I love the movie. I love Queen Latifah. She's hilarious in that movie. It is such a good movie, such a good movie. If you haven't seen The Last Holiday, you need to just like go now, right now, stop whatever you're doing and go watch that movie. So good. Number nine is Love Actually. I definitely don't let my kids watch that movie, <laughs> um, but I love Love Actually. I have to be honest with you guys, I wish that they would just cut out completely the like the storyline of the um, body double couple, because it's just so unnecessary. It takes the entire movie and puts it as something that kids can't watch. Are there other parts that are questionable? Yes, but that part makes it completely unwatchable until you're a lot older. In my opinion, for my family and my kids, it just makes it completely unwatchable, which I hate. So I think there's probably versions you can get of it that don't show that, but I just feel like, oh, that was so unnecessary. I get it, it's it's fine. Like as an adult, it's like, whatever, I'm, I don't love it. I don't, eh, I'm just indifferent to it but I hate that I feel like it puts a different spin on the rest of the movie for that one little storyline that isn't even a big storyline. It's just like, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe you, maybe you feel me on that one, but love actually, love that movie. And the last one is Pastor's Wife with Whitney Houston. <sighs> First of all, Whitney Houston's voice is just incredible, but that movie is so good. Not necessarily a Christmas movie, but it's definitely a Christmas movie to me. Um, I really, really love it. It's very sweet. Denzel Washington's character is just so like endearing. I, again, I don't know what else to say other than I love it. I don't wanna like give away too much in case you've never seen these movies. I don't wanna talk too much about them because um, I don't wanna give anything away. Put it on your list if you haven't seen it. I think everybody probably has, but if you haven't, put it on your list. All right, so those are my top 10. I could keep going, you guys. I have like a whole list of probably like 18 or 20 movies here, but I really wanted to cut it down to 10. I love Christmas time, I love Christmas movies. I have to hold myself back every year from starting to watch them in like October. I have to force myself to wait till after Thanksgiving to listen to Christmas music and to watch Christmas movies because I love them so much. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please tell me down below in the comments what are your favorite Christmas movies? What do you like to watch? Are any of my favorites the same as yours? Any movies I maybe have not seen that you can recommend to me? Let me know down below in the comments. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you've not already and I will see you guys again tomorrow for another Vlogmas video. Bye guys.